it's just regular coffee. Anyway, oh my gosh, have any of you guys ever tried these? It's my first time trying them in like, it's full of small one. It's awesome. Like a chocolate mushroom thingy. For those of you who are chocoholics, get high off the chocolate or shrooms, doesn't matter. It's good. Anyway, hello there. My name is Kay now. I know for sure it doesn't matter. And I have some ridiculous habits other than biting my fingernails or eating pickled spinach pizza from Subway, which, by the way, is awesome. So you should totally try that. So with that, let's start. enough when I go to sleep I always find my bed full of water bottles and this is because of two reasons one I'm too lazy to go put them away and two every time I pass by bottled water I get one unaware that there's already a ton of it in my bed half full which ties into my second habit leaving those bottled waters around my house I'll already have a bottle of water out, and sometimes I forget where I place it, so I just go get another one. Now, usually, I would get in trouble for wasting water like this, but I like to get away with it by blaming it on my auntie. She didn't do it. Um, auntie, if you're watching this, you probably shouldn't come home at this moment. There are a lot of misplaced bottled waters. Number three, I like to sing and dance my heart out to K-pop songs when nobody's looking. Don't judge. Yogi Butara, Motu Moyara, we gon' party like. Let me put it down another way. Number four. At that times, I would just go to the refrigerator, open it, and then just stand there. Not because I'm hungry or anything, but I actually don't know why I do it. Strange. But I do get in trouble for it, believe me when I say that. Lastly, when in school, I usually take my neighbor's pencils or erasers when they least expect it. It's just for fun, but later I forget and end up keeping it. So, just like before, I end up with a bed full of erasers and pencils. But when I need them, they all disappear. So let me know if you can relate to my habits or if I'm a complete weirdo by leaving a comment down in the comment section. But now that I think about it, you guys should really try that spinach pickle pizza. You know what? I'm a dare you. If you do happen to stop by Subway, you should get your pizza however you like it. But add pickles and spinach on it. There's three reasons why you should do that. Well, four. One, because I dared you to. Two, because it's healthy. Three, because it's like the bomb. And four, it only costs five dollars. If you do take on my challenge, you should take a picture of you and the pizza, or just the pizza, I don't care. Send it to my email, which is right here. And tell me about your experience eating the pizza. Was it good? Was it nasty? And with that, you could dare me to do something. I don't care what it is. Can it involve pizza? I hope it involves pizza with pickles and spinach. So that's all today, guys. Thank you and have a nice day. Bye. Just been dared.